must save me. Uh, so, both my trap and my vessel failed, but how? When I saw him, I... I just couldn't... The destined one then arrived and bested me. Now the monkey has ransacked our hollow. A mere monkey showing such disrespect. Your wound was recovering. <sighs> Now it's getting worse. Fear not. I'll deal with him. But before that, that thing of mine... I do. Very well. Despite all your failures, you led the destined one here. I should reward you for that. But the thing I gave you... Now I must have it. Oh, 
Changed a bit. You fool.
初见的交通。月光在西别的城楼。思念是眉间的忧。寻常最长久，汹涌如交流，坦踏似轻舟，有你相伴，这一路多么多么。从立春到立秋，在那一刻，我爱上你的所有。忘了是心田的狗。指引是相拥无言，怨天黑化到你，总会说不。Strength, but not in wisdom. You've not only hurt Bajia and his darling, but also laid waste to the seal of the High Ones. A grave misdeed. Mortal or immortal, all seek to break from the past and start anew. Yet destiny, like a lover's tongue, speaks one way and means another. Though you may savor it yourself, you can never tell if you truly want it or not. Even the sacred gourmand remains mundane if he clings to the ties of love. 
He was an admiral of the court, a pig in the mountains, and Bajia in the journey. Yet his nature remains unchanged. <laughs> so be it, a guileless fool may know less sorrow. The posts of the court have stood unchanged, but the same seat might not always be held by the same immortal. So too, the seven spider guides. They boast an endless procession of generations. Long ago, the many-legged one was subdued by Bodhisattva Pilanpur and locked on Purple Cloud Mountain. Only by a plea from the celestial court was he spared. The immortals dispatch minions to enact their will, while they remain serene as if playing a game of chess. Pity those pawns. They know full well what they are, yet they cling to false hopes and even take pride in it. This one must be a high immortal from the court. Amid the trials of the seven spiders and the many-eyed one, it was Bodhisattva Pilanpur who lent a hand. No aid from the court was given. But... Wukong is ever heedless of rules. He might have sought higher places for help. This rooster is Pilanpur's son, the Dawn Star, he was called. Through him is forged the Weaver's Needle, the one that subdued the many eyed master. More than that, he once crowed a giant she scorpion to death. Indeed, he is a bane to all insects.
time was, I guarded the Celestial River with my boys, 80,000 strong, and the puny revenants dare to impede me. That grand transformation of mine was the only reason you're still standing here. A proper kneel to show gratitude would be appropriate, no? Fooled me once, never again. Deceptive tactics like this pose no threat. I'll go size them up first. Keep pace, boy. 